Apoptosis is a carefully regulated process that is part of normal development and ultimately results in cell death. The study of apoptosis is important because modifications to this process have been implicated in cancer, autoimmune diseases, and degenerative conditions. Many different methods have been developed that target the various hallmarks of the apoptosis. However, detection of apoptotic cells in tissue samples represents a challenge. The tunnel assay, introduced in 1992, is the most widely used method to detect apoptotic cells within tissue samples. A hallmark of late-stage apoptosis is the fragmentation of DNA. To detect DNA fragmentation terminal transferase, or TDT, a specialized DNA polymerase is added. The TDT incorporates unlabeled and fluorescently labeled nucleotides onto the ends of the fragmented DNA. The apoptotic cells are now fluorescent labeled. There are several commercially available fluorescent tunnel assays. However, all the assays are not created equally. Important criteria for consideration when selecting a tunnel assay are its sensitivity and specificity. Also of importance is the ability to multiplex and archive your samples for later analysis. The Clicket Plus tunnel fulfills all the criteria for consideration. Three emission colors are available, allowing for numerous multiplex options. The mild reaction conditions used retain the signal from fluorescent proteins and cell morphology. Additionally, the photostable alexafluor dyes allow for maximal archivability. The Clicket Plus tunnel assay differs from the traditional tunnel assay in that a smaller, more efficiently incorporated alkyne labeled nucleotide is used. After incorporation, an azide containing fluorescent dye is added, and after a short 30 minute Clicket reaction, the alkyne and the azide group are specifically joined. To demonstrate the specificity of the Clicket Plus tunnel assay, formalin-fixed parafilm-embedded tissue samples were treated with DNAs to replicate the DNA fragmentation found during apoptosis. The lack of a signal in the no DNAs control demonstrates the specificity of the assay. The Clicket Plus tunnel fulfills all the criteria for consideration. Three emission colors are available, allowing for numerous multiplex options. The mild reaction conditions used retain the signal from fluorescent proteins and cell morphology. Additionally, the photostable alexafluor dyes allow for maximal archivability. An overlay of all the images results in a content-rich experimental result. This high degree of specificity for the Clicket Plus tunnel can be seen in several different tissue types. The specificity, ability to multiplex, and increased signal strength of the Clicket Plus tunnel assay works with many tissue types. The image shows the results in kidney and whole intestine.